Washington News investigation raises the question, what kind of public records are passed around in the cloud? The state attorney in Orange County has been asked to investigate allegations that Mayor Teresa Jacobs and other officials might not be providing public records stored on so-called file-sharing systems. Now, this comes one year after the mayor and four current and former commissioners paid civil fines for breaking sunshine laws. Western News political reporter Greg Fox uncovered this story. He tells us how long the mayor's office used the file-sharing system. These are the two biggest questions that are being raised in this new investigation. Is the mayor's office fulfilling public records requests by making available all information, including what's in a so-called drop box, and who has access to it? Orange County Mayor Teresa Jacobs has built her political reputation on the principle of transparency. Now she's being challenged on it. One of the groups behind a failed sick pay initiative in 2012 is alleging the mayor and her staff are hiding public records in Dropbox. The online system provides cloud-based file sharing that only lets you see those documents if you have an account with a password. And we think if there's nothing to hide, she'll agree to an independent investigation. Stephanie Porte is with Organize Now, which requested the Comptroller audit any and all drop boxes used by county government, saying there is absolutely no way for the public to know whether public records were withheld from view and whether drop box was used to allow lobbyists or other non employees to improperly influence decisions. I'm concerned there's a second set of books um, that the public is not able to see and that there may be documents that are not part of the public records. A spokeswoman for Mayor Jacobs tells me 10 members of her communications team have access to the Dropbox and, quote, whenever there is a public records request, all records that pertain to that topic, digital, cloud, and hard copies, are searched. But the Comptroller decided allegations of violations of the public records law do not fall within the purview of my county audit division. She instead forwarded the allegations of potential public records law violations to State Attorney Jeff Ashton. His office confirms it's reviewing the claims. The First Amendment Foundation says no public official can use file sharing systems to temporarily keep records from public view. Quote, at the point it is created and shared, it becomes a public record. So if they are putting it in Dropbox, it's a public record. West 2 News has asked the mayor's office to show us the contents of the Dropbox. So far, we're waiting to hear back. In Orange County, Greg Fox, West 2 News.